For this first DIY, search for a Starbucks mug PNG from Google, then print and cut it out. Then to make it durable, stick a piece of thick paper to the mug. And carefully cut out the round logo part. Behind the logo part, glue a thick strip of paper. Do not put glue on the ends of the strip that are out of the round logo. Then put some hot glue. Make sure to put it only the edge of the mug. After that, put another piece of thick paper on that. You don't need to cut a hole like me on this green paper, but I just made the hole just to show you how this works. And now you see that the Starbucks logo part is staying safe, being inside of the mug. Put the sticking out part into the space between the two overlapping papers. We had a hole in the back, so we need to put another layer on the back. And you are all done. As I said, you don't have to make a hole on the covering green paper in the first place, so you do not even need this stage. You can write some secret messages on the round part. Like, I love you, like you, and so on. <laughs> This Nutella card is just too simple. I used this yellow paper. The size of this was about 8 by 5 inches. Then I also printed out this addicting Nutella shape from Google. First, fold the paper in half and attach a thicker piece of paper behind it so it could be much durable and look a lot nicer. Then, it's already the last step. I wanted to make the Nutella a bit stick out, so I put quite a lot of hot glue more than I needed. I tried to let the glue dry a little, so it could stick out better from the card. For this minion card, First, you need a paper that's thick enough to make a card. The size of this mint paper was about 10 by 4 inches. You also need some decorative papers and some kind of printed pictures you have. I personally like the minions so much, so I printed out this cute bob from Google. First, fold a card like this. I try to make the sides overlap each other. Then, on one side of the card, I put this starry paper. And for the other one, I put this shiny gold one. Then, stick these cute little things to the card. And you're almost done. Now, as you can see, the sides are overlapping. Mark a dot on where the longer part ends and carefully cut along the heart until you reach the dot you put. Then you can put the minion part to the behind of the hearts. I'll let you decorate the inside of this card and other than that, you are all done. This card turned out so adorable. It's, been a while. Let me tell you it's also very simple to make this heart card. I used this little thick paper. The size was about 8 by 4 inches. You also need one more piece of thick paper for the inside. Using this red sticky felt, I cut out this heart. I used Google again to get the heart pattern. Then fold this paper in half. And just simply put the heart on the card. Then you are all done with outside decoration. But 
for this card, the more highlighted part is the inside decoration. First fold the paper like this. Then mark two parallel vertical lines and cut along the lines. Now fold it again, making the cut part stick out like this. Then stick the paper to the card and put another heart inside. I used a bit thick paper for this heart. Ta-da! Now you see the heart popping up. You can write something on the heart inside or on the bottom part of the card. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!